Okay, in this video, we're going to add the link to the post, and we will click it, it's going to take you to the post. Go to cPanel, Templates, create a new template group. template group. Let's call it uh, page and uh, none. We don't want to duplicate the first one, otherwise it's going to copy the whole HTML into this one. Save template group. And it automatically creates a index page. You go back to the text editor, you can see we have a home group and a page group. Home page group. Now, we want to create a link to take you to take us to that template to the uh, page uh, page group, which is this one. Okay, let's create post full post. Save. And let's see if we can access that by just typing in the URL. Uh, Index.php slash <coughs> post. slash. What do we call this one? page I right. we have full post so what we don't what we don't go ahead and just copy the uh, the other bootstrap post uh, page which is hey okay, this is a uh, home page blog box okay just this one you can just View page source and just copy this. You don't have to go back to the to the folder. All right. Let's go inside the the template page group index. Where you have the full post. This text. Copy this. Refresh. See what happens. All right, we got some text, but it's not linking to the bootstrap like the home group uh, folder, like this folder, even though it's the same URL. Well, because this is a new template, this is not the default default group. You we'll go back to the the home. This is the default. You see the green green color here. You click the edit default group so here so this is this one can is directly have direct access to the uh, bootstrap uh, CSS and JavaScript so for the page group the new one okay for this one we need to add the uh, URL the uh, you are uh, site you are tag so it's basically saying just go to the main you know the group folder and, and get access to the to the the CSS site you are I think it's that one I think that's there see yeah. Yeah, here we go we need to at the side you are attached to the scripts to the side URL let's copy here alright let's refresh again make sure everything's working okay with that mm, everything here we don't have the image but we're gonna use our own image uh, background image. This is from uh, Bootstrap. You can just add this one if you want to 
at the tag you want to keep the the image that came with the, with the pose so now what we're gonna what we need to do is um, go back to the home page we need to link this uh, title create a link and send it to the depending on which title so which pose send it to the correct uh, pose for that we need to go we need to go to the home group and this is the title where we where we want to create the link so for that we're gonna create a a tag calibrate calibrate whatever URL title the path is equal to page page would be the uh, the template the we create page okay did I save it yeah oh hold on we need to add the title uh, tag inside there the link save it refresh and so you can see once you try to go over it to hover the title it's a link okay sounds seems like a explore okay you go to the URL forget about this this is a uh, hard coded so you don't have to replace this but if you look look at the URL this is the post that we click let's go back let's try this one as you can see this is the course uh, so it's working correctly all we have to do now is just to replace this uh, hard code text uh, this text the title with the uh, the entry with entries from the from the cpanel so let's go and do that next let's go back to the page group where we're going to show the content and you can see this is the title subtitle so we can just go ahead and basically do the same like uh, like in the home group go to channel entry tags copy this let's copy one here this first one there because we want to show the title and this is the content the whole content here so we can just go ahead and just can go ahead and delete all of this stuff again okay and the, we don't need the title here because the title is gonna be up here an entry post need to limit it's gonna be one title by the other one subtitle and eventually you can you can replace this with their uh, Whoever with the uh, the author of the post, gonna have the content here. P tag. I forgot what's the uh, post content. Is there the tag post content? Okay, let's save it. loop title subtitle post content let's see let's cross fingers 
It should be the same. Oh, it should be the other one. Title. Okay. But you can see this is another title. This is the subtitle. Let's go back to the home page and click the other one. Click this one. No, yeah. And it's right here. And it's full. So this is how you link uh, two templates each other with this code right here. So in the next video, what we're gonna do because if you could, you can you notice we're repeating a lot of the same. You see the uh, head is the same for both. We're repeating a lot of the same code, so just to keep things right and not repeating the same the same code, uh, we're gonna create layouts to use use one one time the the code and you don't have too many you know uh, repeated code. So that's was the next video. That's what we're gonna do.